Hello, I'm in a bit of a hurry. I'm trying to find Lola's lunchbox. Here we go. Oh, yes! Well, now it's time to play Lola's lunchbox. You know the rules. We have to find as many pink milks as we can. Off we go! Right, there's one. Oh, it's a red tomato. That's not good. There's two. I should be able to do this blindfolded, but I can't. There's two pink milks. <laughs> yes! There's a level one. Whoa. OK, and another red tomato. And there's a pink milk that's just bounced out. Can you see any more? Please help me. Ooh. OK, point, shout. Tell me where they are. There's a red one. There's another red one. Oh, there's a pink, yes. Oh, there's another red. Oh, no. Lola is going to be pleased if I find all of the pink melts. I'm not too pleased if I find all of the red tomatoes. And it's time up. One, two, three, four red tomatoes and only one, two, three pink melts. Sorry, Lola. <laughs> <laughs> Concentrating. Hop, 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 I had this little hop. sister Lola. She's hop. small and very funny. Ooh. What about skipping, Charlie? I'm good at doing skipping. Today Lola is very excited because it's sports day on Friday and this is Lola's first ever sports day. Ah, I love sports days. Wow. But what race am I going to do? That's what we're going to find out. <laughs> what sort of races are there? There's running. I don't like running. Jumping. Not jumping. Because my legs are only quite short. What about the obstacle race? Octopus race. Hmm. No, obstacle race. You'll like the obstacle race. Can you pass me that Wellington boot? Is there a dressing up race, Charlie? I love dressing up. Uh-uh. Dad, we're ready. Lotta, in a minute, we are going to try out all of the races that are very different. Very different. OK. And then when we find one we like, we can choose it for sports day. So it should be the race that you like the very most. The very most. Yes. Let the games begin. Right, the first race will be the three-legged race. OK, do up your scarf. <laughs> no, like this. Stand side by side and tie your middle legs together. So you have one, two, three legs. That looks easy peasy. Easy peasy, lamb squeezy. What's <laughs> <laughs> up? Well, it's not going to be the three-legged race. Nope. What else? What about leapfrog? Yes, yes, yes. We know all about from leaps. Ribbit. 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 But it's sort of like that. Ribbit. But in this race, you've got to leapfrog over somebody. Like this. <gasps> oh! <laughs> that is good. This is the last one, and I think it is the best. The obstacle race. Octopus race? That's what I said. You got your run twice around the Wellington boot, do three skips with a skipping rope. Two circles of the hoop, bounce the ball on the racket, and the first ticket to the finishing line is the winner. OK? Say go, Charlie. On your marks. Get set. Go! <laughs>
Skittles. Well done, Lata. <laughs> I think the octopus race is the race that I like the most. Lola, come back. Lola, Sizzle. Come back. But what is Lola going to do on sports day? I don't know. Lotta was very good at that octopus thingy, wasn't she? And you and Marv are really good at running with three legs. But I don't know what race I'm going to do, Charlie. Hmm. I know. The egg and spoon race. Yes, the egg and spoon race. Because I love eggs and I love spoons. What is the egg and spoon race? You have to run the whole race with your egg balanced on your spoon. Like this. And you must try not to drop it while you run. It's quite difficult. I like the egg and spoon race. Voila. Then Lola. Try to do egg and spoon all day long. Oh. Oh. And Mum made Lola lots of hard boiled eggs so she could practice. Oh. Thank you, Charlie. Are you sure you want to do the egg and spoon race, Lola? It really is hard. Oh yes, Charlie. I am completely, really sure the egg and spoon race is my best. Ugh. The egg and spoon race? But that's the hardest race of all. I know, but she won't give up, Marv. Charlie, have you told her how difficult it is? Oh. Yes, I have. Captain Look, Charlie, yeah. look! Woo! That's amazing, Lola. You've really got it. You are going to be a champion egg and spooner. Thank you! Thank you! Thank you very much! Lola, did you glue the egg onto the spoon? Yes, Charlie. Now it doesn't fall off. You can't do that. Glue is cheating. Oh. I need to find the egg that's not all wobbly. I need a perfect egg from a perfect chicken. <laughs> nope. No. No. <laughs> Ooh. This is the perfect egg, Charlie, and I'm not ever, never going to drop it. But it's OK to drop the egg in the race, Lola. You just have to put it back on the spoon and keep going. No, Charlie, I don't want to drop the egg because it is completely and absolutely perfect. Oh. No, I'm never going to get the egg to stay on my spoon. You will. You just have to concentrate. Look at your egg the whole time. And really concentrate. Do you understand? Mm -mm. Well, it's like when you carry pink milk and you don't want to spill it. Or carrying something really precious. <gasps> like Mum's vase. Ma Lola, I don't think you should touch Mum's... OK, but concentrate and walk very, very slowly. Slowly. Don't take your eyes off it for one single minute. I am really, really concentrating. <laughs> well done, Lola. <laughs> I did it, Charlie, did you see? Yes, because you concentrated and that's what you've got to do in a race. Oh, I can concentrate, Charlie. I know I can. I am really, really, really concentrating. Concentrate, concentrate, concentrate. 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 Uh, <laughs> I think I've got it, Charlie. Charlie said, concentrate, concentrate. 
Concentrating. Charlie. <laughs> See, my egg is still on my spoon. Ooh. 